Hey, what's up? Happy Monday, everybody. It's fucking Chanel. And today, we are going to review the new Agoraphobic Nosebleed EP ARC on Relapse Records. Now, already, does this sound like fucking Agoraphobic Nosebleed? No. This is a fucking sludge album. Just... 110%. JR from Pig Destroyer helped the uh, cat out with the lyrics, which are seriously incredible. Awesome picture of like a sick bed. Like, this is like a concept record about like Cat's mom who like was dying of like cancer and like schizophrenia and shit and was like going crazy. But, um, I put side B on, uh, this track is called Null, it's, uh, my favorite on the album, the longest song too, and it has these awesome, it sounds like I Hate God, like, if I Hate God, Take His Nita for Pain had better production, boom, these three songs would be what came out of it, but, like, I stood at every angle to make this moment real, remembered her hands are my hands, studied her stopped heart open arc peel, I stood at every angle to make this moment real, fingered a scar and gave, fingered a scar I gave her that never wholly healed, stroked and brushed her brow of snowy strands. Sorry about that. <laughs> I stood at every angle to make this moment real. Remembered her hands are my hands. But like back to the lyrics, like like I said, this is nothing like a Gorpocalypse, which is pretty much just DRI riffs grinded to a vicious fucking level. This is heavy as fuck, and I would love to see it live. All you fuckers that got to see Agoraphobic Nosebleed live at Maryland Death Fest last year, fuck you. You guys are so lucky. But, um, yeah, the lyrics are just incredible. Like, seriously, like, I wish, like, I wish I was this good at, like, writing. It's so good, like, you call, I come, these last memories, stop hurting me, why are you doing this to me? I am nobody, not a daughter, my face empty, empty as your eyes when you ask me to end you. You stopped eating months ago, you were meant to die months ago when the cancer was caused by them, I wondered when you would die. Your mind of prison, my last moments with you, get out, get out, I am nobody, not a daughter, empty. But that's on side A, and that's just more killer fucking Scott Hall riffs, proving that Scott Hall can play anything and make it fucking amazing. But, uh, I heard every member of Agoraphobic is gonna have, like, their own, you know, like, non-grind, like, project under the, uh, Agoraphobic Nosebleed name. Like, the artwork is brilliant. As you can hear, the album is great. You have to play it on, uh, 45 RPMs on vinyl, which is, like, kind of weird, but... It's a, it's a 12 inch, I mean, I got it at uh, Repo Records in uh, Philadelphia. I wish the Relapse store was still around, but yeah, awesome pickup. Highly suggest that, you know, you guys, if you can find it, or just go to relapse.com, go on the mail order site, super easy. I. Mine's just a uh, black. Uh, I didn't get a colored one. The colored ones look sick, but this is just all they had. And I was like, I need to have that. Like, it was either this or uh, 
Carcass Choice Cuts. And I, I have Carcass Choice Cuts on CD. Like, I, I wanted to hear the new Agoraphobic Nosebleed, and I was not fucking let down. I, I fucking love this shit, like, I love just, like, heavy, sludgy, doomy fucking riffs, and this is just, it, it's perfect for me, like, don't get me wrong, I love, like, grind, like, I have, uh, behind me, here's, uh, an old, uh, old agoraphobic nosebleed, um, Altered States of America. Uh, hey, there's Scott Hull right there with assholes for eyes. <laughs> I forget. Uh, like this was like a three-inch CD. Yeah, I think Jay. Yeah, Jay Randall has the vagina. <laughs> All the acid tabs like look like the nun and shit with the upside down cross the cover was just like a pedo priest and a bunch of babies eating pills from like a dead baby it's fucking sick <laughs> I love it I love agoraphobic nosebleed they're like one of my like favorite like grime bands but this is like but this is just my shit and the last agoraphobic nosebleed was my personal favorite Until I heard this EP, but when it comes to regular agoraphobic nosebleed, agorpocalypse, fucking A. And over here, you can't really see it, but uh, there's uh, some of the uh, artwork from the, uh, fuck, sorry, there, uh, artwork from the agoraphobic nosebleed converge split, which also rules. Uh, I, again, I don't know where you can find a copy of it, but if you can, because it has fucking Locust Rain on it, which is my second favorite Converge song, and I remember that was the first time I heard Agoraphobic Nosebleed was on that split, and I was impressed because I'd never heard, like, at that point in time, we're talking about 18 years ago. I, I think 18 years ago. No, no, no. Sorry. About 12 years ago, maybe longer than that, was like when I first heard like drum machines and grind together. Like before that, like the only bands I heard that used the drum machine were Godflesh and like some industrial bands. And like I love Godflesh, but I don't love industrial music. Like barely at all there's like three bands i'll listen to and that's that's it but it's mostly i i there's only a couple godflesh albums even that like i'm super into but like i love swans I, but swans aren't industrial but they just have that like crushing machine like fucking sound and it's just rules it rules like this fucking 12 inch rules. This is, well, the new Agoraphobic Nosebleed e put EP arc. 9 out of 10. Get that shit. Because this part coming up, especially, like, where it has, like, some death metal like vocals, like, it's fucking sick. Like, trust me, you'll want to get this after you hear this part of Null. It's so fucking good. But uh, we have Decibel uh, Weekend coming up, and I can't fucking wait. So uh, I hope to see some of you guys there. It is cold outside. So it's a uh, pretty uh, torturous Tuesday. So this is Chanel signing out. Peace and pussy. I just want to hear this part, so I'll just sit here. And look. I found an e my Evil Dead game for PlayStation right here. But yeah, they definitely made an Evil Dead game for PlayStation 1 called Hail to the King. Yep.
Have a good one.